Definitely this watch isn't for women. Yeah, I agree. Hey guys, welcome to a new video. It's been over a month that I've been using the new Apple Watch Ultra and I wanted to talk about my experiences so far and talk about why I agree with this comment that the Apple Watch Ultra isn't for women. Now I say I agree with that because it's actually for everyone. My biggest concerns when getting this watch was that I was coming from the 41 millimeter from 41 to 49. That is a huge jump. I have extremely tiny wrists and obviously I was worried that it was going to be too big. And since then I have adjusted quite nicely. I definitely have not been utilizing all of the features uh, like scuba diving and really doing anything hardcore. I did use it to set a bunch of waypoints and stuff like that, which was fun. Also addressing the comment that this watch isn't for women, I can actually argue that it is geared more towards women, especially because this now does the temperature sensing. I have not been sleeping in this watch only because I don't sleep in watches. If you are sleeping in this, it's using your temperature, which then is going to help you uh, better regulate like your period and know more about your menstrual cycle if you are a person who has that. So for someone to say that this watch isn't for women when it actually has the technology that is for women made me giggle. Now I can understand that person was probably coming from a size perspective and that we usually do have a smaller wrist, but uh, I've adjusted perfectly fine. My past three purchases were the stainless steel or the ceramic Apple watches. So coming from the stainless steel, uh, this was the 41, I just reset it. It's obviously uh, quite the size difference. I reset this this morning and I was shocked when I picked it up. I was like, how did I even navigate on this tiny, tiny little screen? Another thing is that I love the flat design. I really hope they bring that to future watches because I really am enjoying that. So for the pricing, when it comes to the stainless steel, which is what I usually get, the GPS plus the cellular, so it's close to $800. From the price standpoint of me paying to upgrade from the seven to eight to basically get the same thing, didn't make sense. So while this watch is, you know, geared towards adventure and things like that. It's also perfectly fine if you're just an average human being who wants a bigger screen with better battery. Now, with that being said, here are the things I am disappointed about. When I unboxed the original one, I didn't realize I ordered the ocean band, which I did use for a week. It's obviously made to go in the ocean with a wetsuit, things like that. I actually took this to the ocean and sand got under the dial. All I did was give it a quick bath and it came out, which was great. Um, since then, I have gotten the Alpine Loop. Now the Alpine Loop gets very, very dirty. Like, it's already, kind of like a not bright white compared to the ocean band, but I have thrown this in the wash, I have scrubbed it, I have tried to clean this as much as I possibly can, and it just gets really, really dirty. This is only like a couple weeks old, and I've washed it basically at least once a week, and it's just not great. So this is definitely something I'm very upset about. The band that I've been wanting to get is the Trail Loop Band, and my sister actually texted me yesterday saying, hey, I got you a present. I'm gonna go over there in a little bit and get the band and show you guys, and also ask her what her month plus with the Apple Watch Ultra has been like, and see how she's been liking it. Hey, Jess. Hey. I was just talking about you in my video. Oh my gosh. Well, that's something I didn't know about. So you got me a present. I did. I'm here for the Oh, you, oh you. <laughs> I thought there was gonna be more uh, to no. it. Um, so here's your, I feel so weird I'm on this side. It's weird, because you we have to on... switch, we gotta switch. No, I'm already no, over here. Sit over here. I'm so already so over here. here. Just, just scoot over, you gotta scoot over. Oh. I feel so weird. Hi. Here's your gift. Thank you so much. Okay, so this is the Close Your Hide Your Face. So this is, oh my face is in the way. This is the Trail Loop. What color is this? Blue, gray. What's the, yeah, gray, blue. Blue, gray, Trail Loop, small, mm. medium. $99. Oh, yes, expensive gift. I'll Venmo you. It's okay, no, I wasn't, because you helped me film today, so this is a gift for you. So, I was talking about how dirty, look how dirty this is. I know, mine got so disgusting. It does clean up pretty nice. I scrubbed mine. I did too, but it gets dirty the next, I, I mean, I cleaned this a couple days ago. Yeah. I throw it in the wash, but this is gonna be nice. So I came over here to help you film, and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna be doing a 30 day with the Apple Watch Ultra, and you go, I just filmed one. I, I'm, it's almost completely edited. Yeah. Mine is not. Really. I shot it so. last Friday. Are you having a good time with it? Are you still enjoying it? Oh my god, it? I love it so much. 
so much. So what's funny is that this actually just looks like this when it's dirty. Because <laughs> it's it like does. tan. Yeah. Oh no. Which is kind of crazy. So I've been through the ocean band, I've been through the um, alpine, and now we have the trail, which I think is gonna be easier to use. This one's still kind of a pain to put on. It is, like this one is kind of a pain. It also gets dirty, but honestly, those little clasps, like if you're out doing some serious adventures, yeah, this is what you want. Like you want this thing. It's so industrial. It stays hooked. For sure. I mean, half the time I can't even get it off. I mean, I'm great. just using everyday use, like literally yeah. waking up and existing. But this is cool because it has this little like loop here. Mm -hmm. So you're 30 days plus, you had it for longer because you had a review unit. Well, um, what's your experience? Positive, negative? Do you have you thought about the old watch? So here's the thing: I bought the Apple Watch 8, which I haven't even opened it. Oh, I well, there you have think it. I'm gonna return it, but I think I'm, I'm I might be past my return date. So yeah, you are. Mm. Well, I love it a lot. Me too. It's seriously is just a really great watch. It's been it's been really fun. I mean, I took this thing on crazy trails. I was actually in the ocean. I was on hikes. I went and did all these wild, crazy things, and it. Like I just wore it. I've done nothing. I've I've done a tiny hike. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thanks, Jess. Thanks for yeah. my new band. Um, and uh, you guys can check out her 30 day with the Apple Watch Ultra uh, video. I, I started this video because I said um, by saying that this watch isn't for women, and it's not. Who's it for? Everyone. Oh, I was gonna be like. Yeah. I think it's for me. It's for everyone. It's also especially for women because it does temperature sensing and uh, helps you. Uh, keep track of your menstruation and ovulation. So, yeah. So the comment who said it's not for women, it's like extra for women. It's actually more for women than for men. Yeah. So, so mm. take that. Take it. Take take that. Take, take it. it. Take it. Bye. See ya.